How to set up a test. To set up a test on the Satro infiltrometer, press the power menu button on the control unit to power on the device. The last test results will appear on the screen. Press enter to view the test setup screen. This screen is used to name the test and configure test settings. Select name to create a test name. Highlight letters and press enter after each one. Select done and press enter to save the new test name. See the manual for more detailed instructions. Configure test settings by selecting settings. Different soil types may require different parameters for an optimum infiltration test. Adjust settings to change pressure heads, soak time, number of cycles, and hold time, as well as to inform the control unit of the insertion ring depth. This is a table of recommended settings. Set the desired hydrostatic pressure. Hydrostatic pressure for the low and high pressure heads must be between 0 and 40 centimeters. For more detailed information about hydrostatic pressure, see the user manual. Set the number of pressure cycles. One pressure cycle is equivalent to a full run at the two different pressure heads. The control unit takes the average infiltration rates at the different pressure heads during the last pressure cycle to calculate field-saturated hydraulic conductivity. Multiple pressure cycles ensure the steady-state infiltration rate was reached. For more information about ensuring steady-state, see the user manual. Set the soak time. During soak time, the infiltrometer applies water to achieve saturation of the soil before beginning the pressure cycles. A good introductory soak time is approximately 20 minutes, though the exact length depends largely on soil type and antecedent soil moisture. During soak time, pressure is maintained at the low pressure head. See the manual for more details. Set the hold time. The hold time determines how long the pressure is held at each pressure head and applies to both pressure cycles. For example, if the hold time is 20 minutes, both the low and high pressure holds for 20 minutes. Select the correct insertion ring depth. After the settings are configured, press back to go to the test setup screen. How to start a test. On the test setup screen, select start. The infiltrometer displays a message to check tubing and connections. Press enter to begin the test. The infiltrometer will pump water from the water tank until the water level reaches five centimeters. It then begins the soak time while maintaining a level of five centimeters. The graph feature displays incremental data during a test. The infiltrometer records a data point every minute throughout the duration of the test. It's not necessary to supervise the system during a test, but check the water level intermittently to ensure a constant supply. Test results will display automatically at the end of the test. See the manual for details on viewing graphs of flux, water level, and pressure. To stop a test, press back on any of the reading screens and select stop to cancel the test. The Saturo downloader application is used to download the data from Saturo, erase stored data, set the date and time, and check for firmware updates for Saturo. Download the application from the Meter website before beginning the following steps. Connect the USB cable to USB ports on a computer and on Saturo. Open the Saturo downloader application on the computer. Select the file type by selecting Edit, Preferences, and then Data File, and choosing the appropriate file type. Data can be downloaded as an XLSX or CSV file. Select the proper COM port and click Download. After the download is complete, a prompt will ask if the data stored on the device should be erased. Select Yes or No. If you need more details on how to operate the Saturo, 
You can find the user manual on the Meter website or contact our Saturo experts.